According to available information, the Russian Aerospace Forces, VKS, have recently acquired the 6th L-76MD-90A military transport aircraft manufactured in 2024 at the Aviastar branch of PJSC Ilyushin, a subsidiary of PJSC United Aircraft Corporation of Rostec State Corporation in Ulyanovsk. The Ilyushin Aviation Complex is the developer of the IL-76MD-90A, a modernized military transport aircraft. It is also referred to by its codename, IL-476. The advanced technology and enhanced capabilities of this aircraft represent a substantial improvement over the older IL-76MD model. Modernization of the plane model includes over 70% new systems compared to its predecessor. The first flight of this aircraft took place in Ulyanovsk in December, according to reports. The total number of built IL-76 MD-90A aircraft, including prototypes, is 30. Aviastar delivered five of these new models to the VKS in 2024. The military received them in July, August, September, October, and November of 2024. Under the 2020 contract with the Russian Ministry of Defense for the production of 14 IL-76 MD-90A aircraft craft by the Aviastar facility, the six aircraft delivered in 2024 are believed to be the 8th through 13th units. Following a 2012 agreement with the Ministry of Defense for the delivery of 39 aircraft valued at 139.42 billion rubles, approximately 1.25 billion US dollars, Eviastar began producing IL-76 MD-90A aircraft. The Ministry of Defense renegotiated the contract with Eviastar in May 2020 under new terms in response to substantial delays and increased costs. The revised agreement scheduled the final delivery of 13 aircraft from the 2012 contract for 2022. In 2021, a new 2020 contract for 14 aircraft came into effect. The initial aircraft constructed under this new contract was delivered at the conclusion of 2022. Therefore, Eviastar delivered six aircraft to the Ministry of Defense in 2024, instead of the eight originally planned aircraft, as previously reported. The facility has previously delivered six of these aircraft in 2023, five in 2022, two in 2021, three in 2020, officially delivered in January 2021, and three in 2019, with two technically completed in 2018. The IL-76 MD-90A maintains the external appearance of its predecessors while incorporating substantial internal improvements. The PS-90A-76 engines, which have a thrust of up to 14.5 tons, equip the new model, while the standard D30KP2 engines have a thrust of up to 12 tons. Compared to previous models, it exhibits a 12% reduction in fuel consumption efficacy. The transport boasts a modern glass cockpit with digital displays, enhancing operational efficiency and situational awareness. Sophisticated avionics systems and nine multifunctional displays equip it. The cargo compartment is 24.5 meters in length and can accommodate a variety of configurations for the transportation of personnel or cargo, including the ability to airdrop for military operations. For the delivery of cargo and soldiers, the IL-76 MD-90A now has a payload capacity of up to 60 tons and a range of up to 5,000 kilometers. A modernized landing gear system equips the plane, significantly enhancing its operational capabilities, particularly in diverse environments. The landing gear undergoes reinforcement to support a maximum takeoff weight of 210 tons and a maximum landing weight of 170 tons. This durable design ensures operational safety, even in the presence of large loads during military transport missions. The IL-76 MD-90A is capable of operating from both equipped and unequipped airfields, including those with concrete and dirt runways. This capability allows the deployment of the aircraft in various operational scenarios, including remote or forward operating bases with limited infrastructure. The aircraft is capable of operating efficiently in severe climatic conditions, regardless of whether the temperature is exceedingly low or high due to the increased energy intensity of the new wheels. The landing gear has been upgraded to provide enhanced characteristics for control and indication during both ground operations and flight. This improvement assists pilots in more effectively managing the aircraft during the departure and landing phases. A sophisticated cargo management system equips the new model, enhancing its operational efficiency 
and adaptability. The cargo cabin has an interior volume of 321 cubic meters and measures 24.5 meters in length, 3.45 meters in breadth, and 3.4 meters in height. This enables the aircraft to transport a diverse array of cargo configurations, such as personnel and major military equipment. The aircraft is furnished with a cargo ramp that can be lowered to facilitate the effortless loading and unloading of heavy and oversized cargo. In order to optimize the loading process, this slope can be positioned horizontally or at a variety of angles. Electric hoists and draw winches equipped on the IL-76 MD-90A facilitate the movement of heavy cargo into and out of the aircraft. These devices facilitate rapid turnaround periods by improving the efficiency of ground operations. Light rollerways with a monorail system facilitate the smooth movement of cargo during loading and discharging operations in the cargo compartment. This feature is especially beneficial for the transportation of large goods, such as military vehicles. A sophisticated aerial delivery system equips the aircraft to airdrop personnel and cargo from altitudes ranging from 300 meters to 8,000 meters. It is suitable for rapid deployment scenarios due to its ability to lower platforms loaded with equipment using parachutes at speeds ranging from 220 kilometers per hour to 400 kilometers per hour. The cargo handling system is capable of accommodating a variety of configurations, including the transportation of up to 126 parachutists, 145 personnel, or 225 troops in a double-deck configuration. It is also capable of accommodating stretchers for medical evacuations. When equipped with specialized modules, the cargo handling system of the IL-76 MD-90A can fulfill a variety of functions, including troop transport, medical evacuation, and firefighting missions. Now, why do you think there are no export orders for this plane yet? Let us know in the comments. Please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. Please also take membership in our channel to encourage us.